but yeah. that hurts a lot. April, bye bye. Yeah, bye bye. Good girl. Good morning, everybody. Happy Monday. Ray is just taking April off to childcare, and I am going to hang out with this kid. Yeah. He's so chill in this bouncer. Then I'll play with him for a bit, and then he'll have some more breakfast, and then he'll have some more brunch. And then some lunch and some more lunch. Never ending feeding. Uh, last night was a pretty rough night for me. Um, he cluster fed pretty much from midnight until about four. Um, and I just had enough. So I passed him to Ray so I could get a little bit of sleep. Thankfully, I managed to sort of just pass out after I gave him to Ray and slept until about seven. So that's three hours. So that's good. So today is pretty much just a getting stuff done day while April's not here. Um, and also taking care of the baby day. My friend is coming around with her little girl as well to meet meet little Cooper. Happy Tuesday, Tuesday, yes. So while Cooper is asleep and happy to sleep on Ray, um, I am going to be editing. Uh, falling a little bit behind with the editing, but hoping to catch up like now. We had a visitor this morning. My friend Amber came around um, with her little boy just to visit and say hi to Cooper. And he has been cluster feeding quite a bit today. So I'm hoping that he has a bit of a break now to give me a break. Feeling a bit better today. I had a little bit of extra sleep yesterday because I was just feeling so tired. So I'm just going to continue editing and then uh, we are going to pick up April and she has a chiropractor appointment which we're also going to take Cooper to to have the chiropractor just do a once over for him as well. That was like a two hour chiropractor appointment. We had both April's checkup and then we had him, his first appointment. Um, and he's actually got quite a few little issues that need to be worked on. He kind of adjusted him a little bit and got him kind of feeling a bit better, I think. But basically he's got a little bit of bad hips, um, not hip dysplasia or anything, just sort of stiff hips. Yeah. And he's got a bit of a weird thing Vortex. in his neck where yeah. if his neck goes forward, he, it's like an uncomfortable for him. So a lot of the time he likes to put his neck back because it's more comfortable, um, which isn't a good thing. So he's going to try and fix that as well. I, on the other hand, I'm in a lot of pain. You probably see me switching hands a lot of the time with the camera because this, I don't know if I ever showed this, but that hurts a lot. The needle that I had in my hand during birth was in my right hand because they tried my left hand a couple of times and that was the result. They couldn't get it in and now I'm left with this massive ugly bruise and I think I have nerve damage from it because every time I try and grasp something or pick something up or anything I get a twinge of nerve pain like around the hand area and even down into my wrist and forearm. 
So if it continues, I think I'm going to have to go get it checked out. It started to purple up a bit, but yeah, it's still pretty red here. You can see the little like dot there where he tried to put the needle in and failed. This was while I was all in labor as well. This hand I have a bit of swelling from, from just having the needle in there for so long. And I do have a bit of nerve pain in here, but it's not as bad. So yeah, that's pretty much been my main concern today. It's just the pain that I've been feeling in there. Hello everyone. Hello. The late talking night. Yeah. But I'm feeling good today. I had a workout for the first time in like a month. I need to fix my back so bad. Hopefully it was okay. She had a sick, sick tummy. Gave her the bottle and she threw it all up. She didn't have a sleep today at childcare. Then I've had to get somebody to Crazy with it. kid. Yeah. She's never not had at least one sleep during the day. She's had like days where she's only slept like 45 minutes, mm -hmm. but at least that's something. Um, all right, well, we're gonna eat and we'll see you in a bit. Alrighty, it's the next day. Good morning. <laughs> we didn't end the vlog. Um, he had a rough night in terms of a lot of cluster feeding, and then I just passed out because I was so tired. Um, so yeah, that, that happened. My question of the day is, what is the worst bruise you've ever had? This is probably one of the worst I've ever had. I did have a massive one on my thigh once, but it wasn't as painful as this. It just looked bad. What about you? Um, on my arm. I think it was about 15 years ago. Me and some mates were punching each other in the arm at a party. As you do. The next day, the bruise is like, like my whole arm. So yeah, let us know in the comments below. Thank you all for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Good morning, afternoon, or night, whatever it is where you are. And we'll see you all today slash in the next vlog. <laughs> Bye. See you in a sec. Bye, Cooper. Bye, April.